Okay, Randy Joseph. Yeah, um, I wanted to make a public comment. That's okay. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Um, I wanted to bring up something that's been really bothering me over this last month that was going on in the city of Richmond uh, with people coming in, attacking people on this um, on this task force for not living in Richmond and being a part of Richmond. I think that's disgusting, especially with the with all the work and all the things that's been going on that Tamisha Walker and Andre Soto has put into this city and done for this city to be attacked by not only the mayor, but other community members that do not know half of the work that these two have done in the history of Richmond is disgusting and it's just flat out irritating. And it, it, it shows the divisive nature that people have made this up to be, to make this, try to disingenuize this process, to make this process illegitimate, to attack two people who have been Richmond community members have done so much for Richmond for so long, even before I've been in Richmond. They're part of this community. They've done work in this community. They've left behind um, nonprofits in this community that's secured to support people in this community and to be attacked, um, not only by the mayor, but other people's. Uh, but other people is just plain wrong. And I want to bring that to, to, to attention. This, they didn't ask me to do this. This is me saying this because I'm tired of that. I'm tired of that as a talking point to get. If you want to talk to the task force about the facts and the figures and how we came across to the process, fine, have that argument. But don't come and attack members of, of, of this task force who's been sitting here in this community and been doing all this work for so long. That's the that's the problem I have with these people have been part of this community way too long to be disrespected like that. Thank you. We still are under public comments, so try to keep your comment down to a minute. Marcus and just saying. Um, <clears throat> I just want to second what, what Randy just said. Um, I, I don't I don't know what was said about Andres, but uh, what was said about Mrs. Walker. Mrs. Walker really made me. It made me kind of sick, actually, um, some of the comments that were made by the mayor and uh, about, you know, she's kind of dragging her through the mud. I just wanted to say it to as a fellow task force member, I feel the same way. Um, I, I, I thought it was despicable to be, I mean, just, 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 that's just my opinion. I thought that it was disgusting. And I just wanted to second what Randy was saying. That's all. Thank you, Andres. Yeah, uh, I want I want to thank Randy and and Marcus for your comments, and uh, you know, I've this is not the first time I've been attacked for you know this and many other things uh, because when you stand up for what's right and you stand up for the people, those in power will always try to find a way to try to bring you down, and uh, I've never let that deter me. And so I, I appreciate the support of, of the fellow task force members. And of course, you know, um, shout out of support also for Tamisha. And, you know, perhaps, you know, not at this meeting, but if we ever want to consider a resolution, uh, you know, condemning those kind of remarks, you know, that's something perhaps we can look at, but we have more work uh, ahead of us right now that's, that's more important to worry about small little people like that. Thank you.